Are you recording already? Right. Hello, my name is Marivi Escalona and I'm the Sports Information Director here at TWU. I'm next to amazing company, Coach Pabek and Alyssa Valdez after the 2-0 win over East Central. Um, how do you feel? Second win, second game, second win? Obviously, uh, any time that you get a win in the collegiate game, it is big. Um, you know, we put in a lot of work and effort for it. Um, I told the team that I felt like we left some things on the table. Um, we should have finished the game a lot earlier. We should have finished um, all the amazing chances that we had. And we gave them a little bit of confidence, you know, in the last 20, 25 minutes. But credit to our team for not giving up and continuing to fight. And, you know, we got two amazing goals. Yeah, I mean, two goals, but um, stats don't lie, over 30-something yeah. shots, yeah. so good job on that. Thank you. Um, and we have our second goal scorer, Alyssa Valdez, and your first also um, career goal. How do you feel about that goal? What was going through your head at that moment? Um, I was, honestly, I couldn't believe it because it's my first career goal, like you said, but I couldn't have done it without my team. They separated in the middle because I seen that I had the space and the gap, and I couldn't have done it without them. And they believed in me. They were telling me at halftime and at water break, like, you have the space, take it. And so was Bob X. So, you know, I'm just glad that I have a team that backs me up and, you know, lifts me up and gives me that confidence. Yes, yeah, so we're very proud of you. Um, and not only the goals and the wins, but also no goals scored again, TWU. Um, that's a big, big thing. What can you get from that? Yeah, that is that is huge. Um, anytime that you can shut a team out, um, you know, that says a lot, not only about our for defenders in the back, but just our collective defense overall. Um, that's something that we've really been working hard on. Um, I think we did a really good job of limiting their opportunities and um, making sure that they didn't get many good looks. And, you know, with AV back there playing on both sides of the ball, you know, being a great defender, but also getting involved in the attack that just made things a lot better for us. But, you know, any time that you can get a win and a shutout, um, that's just icing on the cake. Yes. Um, how do you, uh, how are you preparing for this next game? Uh, what are you guys going to be working on over this um, next couple of days to be ready for for what your next game next game is going to be? Um, we have to prepare mentally and like physically. We have to take care of our bodies because you know, like the schedule says, we have three games like within the week and within five days, and you know that's not easy. So we only have like two off days in between, but technically not off days. We still have to like work out and stuff. So. I think we have to eat right, you know, prepare and just take care of our bodies. And we have to like see who we're playing because of course every competitor gets harder and harder. And you know, it's not easy in, on the college level, like you said, so yeah. Anything that you can um, tell us about next game, how you're preparing for that? Yeah, well, first and first and mainly is we gotta get rested. Um, you know, the majority of the team is currently getting ice baths right now. Tomorrow we're going to do a pool recovery. Um, we probably won't be out at our field until Saturday when we play again because uh, we just know how, how important that recovery is. Um, but Oklahoma Baptist is a quality team. They've already played two top 25 teams, so they've been battle tested. Um, they beat us last year on our home field, um, so we know that it's going to be a battle. And they haven't had a game since Saturday, so they've had time to rest and, you know, get scouting reports on us. So, um, you know, we'll be ready. It'll be tough, but we'll be ready. Well, congratulations again for Thank the you. win um, and all the luck for the next game on the road. Thank you so much and go Pioneers.